welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the air sun moon and rising i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back mm, this is wonderful and it's the month of january i want to say thanks to all you aries i don't know why i don't have a lot of aries um, viewers because you guys really get nice um energy vibration reading anyway um, thank you for being here thank you for the support please share these videos please like and share these videos okay for you guys um, in this month is a fire energy so it's going to be a wonderful month for you Aries and you have to deal with a situ situation to deal with an organization and um, whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring the situation with the organization um, as um very important that you deal with the situation in a, the correct way okay so let's look and see what is really happening um in the first week you have the page of pentacles so um the message from the organization we're going to see what is that all about in the first week um, um, the page of pentacles and then in the second week you have the queen of pentacles so um you will be dealing with um, a, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn in the second week in the third week the energy of the tower is here so whatever situation that is going to transpire between the second and the third week last week you have the energy of uh, um, uh, the eye as, as so it's as you have the energy of the eye princess okay so that's water so you have um, two earth signs and then you have the tower and then you have the energy of the eye princess so let's see what is transfer trying between the page of Pentacles and the, um, the um, the Queen of Pentacles whatever is transpiring is um, heartbreak so let's move on and see what is happening between um, the Queen of Pentacles and the Tower. Um, that is the Five of Pentacles. And let's see what is happening between the Tower and the Eye Princess is the Queen, is the, um, the King of Cups. So this is good. Whatever is happening, it is uh, um, positive. It's, it is good. It is a transformation. So um, this is going to be um, a very very good um, this is going to be positive energy so let's see what is this heartbreak and the five of Pentacles is all about seven of Pentacles is coming in and let's see what is this five of pen five of Pentacles and the king of Pentacles is all about you have the queen of Pentacles um, you have the energy of the queen of Pentacles and what is going to be the outcomes of this situation the world so you Aries are the first one to receive the energy of the world and this is wonderful this is fantastic okay so let's go ahead and see and let's take um, an in-depth look at your month okay this is um what is happening okay let's start with the page of Pentacles because there's a situation with an organization and in this organization you have to deal with something and you have the energy of the page of Pentacles so a message is coming from an organization and you're going to have a heartbreak but the energy of the seven of Pentacles is here so it's as if you're working hard whatever is happening whatever is transpiring you have the energy of the seven of Pentacles the outcomes is going to be the energy of a world no matter what is happening because you're going to overcome whatever it's trans um, has transpired here as we look um, whatever you and this Queen of Pentacles is having there's gonna be a heartbreak okay there's gonna be a heartbreak but not to worry about it because the Queen of Pentacles and the tower the Queen of Pentacles the energy of the tower is that um, at the moment she is you know on her own whatever is happening she's on her own she's trying to do everything the energy of the towers whatever that was blocking this person is now clearing up 
and the energy of the tower and um, it's is breaking off and it's removing something that no longer serve you and the, your intuition is um, coming up because it's telling you something about this king about this 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 king of cups and this this person is over the age of 40 whatever is happening this king of cups and this queen of cups have a child together so there is a situation king of cups oh my gosh oh my gosh okay some of you could be receiving a message that your husband has an outside child mm-hmm mm. yeah mm-hmm your husband have an outside child for some of you there is a situation with your parents there is a situation with your parents if your parents is in the spirit world they're coming in as your guides to guide you and to protect you um so say if your mom is in the spirit world or your father's in the spirit world they're coming in as guides to protect you whatever is happening at the moment in the beginning of January because what I'm seeing is a sense of heartbreak there is going to be a sense of heartbreak with an organization whatever that is happening in an organization there's going to be a sense of heartbreak and this energy of the sense of heartbreak is coming up for a lot of people and a lot of energies because of whatever reason that is transparent so whatever the situation that is coming up in um whatever the situation that is coming up in a, a in, in, in this situation with heartbreak let's look at uh, what it is uh, what is this heartbreak about um and it has uh, the energy of the page of Pentacles and it is coming up uh, with a situation of a heartbreak so let's uh, look and, and and see this it's a new beginning whatever that was happening there is a new beginning um, you have uh, is a new beginning it's a new beginning you're working hard there's, there's a new beginning there is as, as if there is going to be a transition and there is a new beginning there's somehow there is two organization there's two things there's two things that is happening there's two organization whatever is happening but whatever is happening for you whatever the message about money that is coming in to you and, and you know this and it's as if you're going to go to this uh, um, person who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and asks for help but this person cannot help you because uh, this person doesn't have it to help you so whatever the situation is that is going on for you it's going to it's going to work out anyway so just give it time because whatever is happening here is that you have enough balance to work the situation out okay there is a situation that some of you are going to find out that your husband have an outside child. I'm receiving this. It's as if you there is an intuition. You're having an intuition. It's as if you have an intuition that the King of Cups, um, a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Pisces, Cancer, or a um, Scorpion. You're going to the intuition that you're getting about this man is that you know whatever is happening his wife is pregnant if someone out there is see seeing a married man his wife is pregnant there's a situation that is coming in and you're seeing this whatever is happening with um, the king of Pentacles and the tower and uh, money because for you Aries the five of uh, Pentacles is here it is the energy of the tower and whatever that is happening on heartbreak because you have heartbreak the five of pentacles and the king of cups and then you have the energy of the seven of pentacles with the queen of uh, um the queen of cups and the queen of cups is a pisces cancer or a scorpion so um there is a situation where you are seen or you're talking to someone who is uh, um who has the energy vibration of this sort of a thing and then you have the energy of the world so whatever the situation is and whatever that was happening and whatever that is transpiring you have and the five 
um, the five of Pentacles there's a judgment but you know and it, it, you have to deal with the king of wands and a tower okay your financial situation is going to be better because whatever that was have, happening whatever that was blocking your financial situation has to do with um, this king of wands the king of wands have been blocking you um, whatever that was happening this king of wands um, was blocking you and now this block is now over okay now you 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 are moving away from this king of wands because here he is so for some of you king of wands whatsoever is happening um, there is going to be an explosion there is going to be an explosion and you're going to be out of um, whatever you king of wands especially if you're old if you're um, 40 and older whatever that you were doing is, is gonna end the tower is going to fall on you that means things that you have been doing is going to blaze up in your face whatever that you were doing is going to blaze up in your face so this is what I'm having so uh, for some of you you know whatever you were doing a judgment is going to come against the king of one and uh, the the energy of the tower and this is twice the tower that is coming up so I'm not sure what you what the older people were doing the people who are older I'm not sure what you were doing or what is transpiring with you because this is going to blow up in your face whatever it is so. okay so we are going to go forward and look and see what is the zodiac energies what is the zodiac energies what is the zodiac energies what is happening what is the zodiac energy that is happening what is happening what is the zodiac energy that is happening for the sun sign people in the month of January and what is the zodiac energy that is happening for the moon sign people in the month of January so let's look and see alrighty uh, for the sun sign people we have the energy of cancer nope um, I think it's Venus and uh, yeah cancer and the um, we have the energy of cancer and the Gemini so whatever is happening for the sun sign people is the energy of a cancer and the Gemini so this is a situation that has been happening and you have the energy vibration of the cancer and the Gemini so whatever that was happening whatsoever that was transpiring we have the energy of the cancer and the general as we move forward we have the energy of the moon and what is transpiring and what the energy of the moon is carrying is the Leos and the Taurus the, the Leos and the Taurus yeah the Leos and the Aries, the Leos and the Aries. So here you are, you Aries coming back in your own readings. You Aries are coming back in your own readings, especially for um, the Aries that are um, of the of the the Moon sort of a thing. Um, it's coming back in um, the reading. So this is good and this is positive. Whatever that is happening and whatever that is transpiring. So um this is good let's see um, what else as a message is here for you guys um, 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 co-create co-create whatever is happening you can co-create with your angels and guides and know that this is going to happen for you so you need to co-create whatever is happening you need to call upon your angels and guides and co-create the situation and things are going you need to learn flexibility you need to learn flexibility whatever is happening whatever is transpiring you need to learn flexibility because this is going to be happening for you so this is good so whatever the situation is whatever that is transpiring in your life you need to learn flexibility and this is going to be good okay so um, 
let's uh, um, please remember to listen to your Sun Moon Horizon sign it is positive it is good um, try and figure out how you're going to deal with certain things because a lot of things is going to be coming up in January for you guys because you have a lot of situation to deal with with an organization and a lot of things are going to be coming up so um, try and um, figure out how you're going to deal with this because it's going to be okay you know don't worry about it namaste Thank you.